an extended analysis on the gold from Extreme Trader. This is Sela speaking. So before we start, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel and kindly leave a comment and share the video. So of course, in this video, my friends, we will continue with the analysis which I have sent on the gold last Sunday. And let's now see what happened. So the gold has reversed exactly, uh, not exactly, but I mean it has reversed at 2319 as we have expected. But of course, this is the old entry. Our new entry was actually right here at 2329. And allow me to show it to you here on actually our free group of Telegram. I have sent an update here on Monday telling everyone to change the entry from 2319 to 2329. Nine, because the difference was actually around 70 or eight, uh, even 100 pips therefore i had to send this notification not even that i have actually sent it again uh telling everybody to keep, to be careful and caution that we have changed the entry of the gold so again that is the reason i'm telling you guys that you really have to join our free group of telegram to receive such updates and notifications on the gold if you guys didn't join it then you must likely had uh entered the sell from the old signal or the old entry and you had to face a losses of 220 pips meanwhile if you have actually used our new entry you actually could have uh faced only 115 pips of loss only before finally become in around 200 pips of profit so we had a winner signal so far running in 200 pips of profit now what's next with the gold especially for those who have missed this entry so based on the daily chart what we can see right now actually i want i would like to just uh, fix our entry to make it like that because this is how it is actually just like that and this is we we have actually eliminated it so right now uh we are still on the daily chart and we have here the broken level of a support trend line which has already become right here a resistance trend line ag exactly as i have predicted of course because we have right here guys a head and a head and shoulders pattern and it's actually a good indicator that the gold will continue the fall especially after seeing the broken level of a support trend line with that very strong bearish breakout candle i mean that is really one setup that hardly misses so what we can do next with this pair in my opinion the gold will continue the fall at least to reach that level of a support why because right now we are actually moving on a downtrend and since we are actually on a downtrend it means that this level of a support most likely is going to be retested again which means the gold still has about around 188 pips more to go before it makes a reversal or continue the fall toward our take profit level which is going to be at 2266 so by moving now to the four hour time frame what i'm going to do is using uh, using right now the magic of trend lines now how do we do that by simply connecting at two levels of a resistance trend line just as, such as this one right here so now we have a template of a resistance trend line now let me just show you an example uh, this level of a resistance trend line has been respected all the way. I mean, for example, if you put it right here on this level of a support trend line, look at that. The market has indeed respected that level as a support trend line. If you place it anywhere, literally anywhere right here, for example, that level of a resistance trend line has been respected as another resistance trend line. That is what we call the magic of trend lines. And I actually have two videos on my channel explaining this in brief. Please look it up. Look at the magic of trend lines to understand better this kind of trading. So how can we use this one now to find the decent entries? By simply moving the same line that I have just drawn here and just simply place it right there exactly at the nearest level of a resistance trend line, which is right here. And here we had one fake breakout. So therefore, uh, we are actually expecting from the gold to reach that level of a support right here at 2000... 305 and it might actually make a pullback and then the same level of a resistance trend line most likely is going to be respected this time again and that means that we can come back to our previous entry exactly at 2019 2319 yes it sounds like a little bit retarded that after all this explanation uh we are back to our <laughs> old entry but guys i had to show it to you and explain to you the reason behind of choosing it i couldn't just simply tell you 
Okay, guys, now you can just use our old entry. No, I cannot do that. I have to explain to you that after the appearance of that fake breakout candle, now our original entry is now valid and most likely is going to be respected finally this time. Another way to confirm this entry is, of course, by still using the same level or actually the same magic of trend lines. Now, how can we do that? By simply draw here another level of a resistance trend line, just like that. So now we can notice that this level of a resistance trend line has been respected. Now, what you will do next is simply drag the very same line that you have just drawn here and just simply place it right there at that level of a resistance trend line. Look at look at that. What's happening right now? Exactly. What's happening right now is that level of a resistance trend line is also being respected. And that's the reason the gold has reversed exactly from that point. Look at that. That is the reversal happened right here because of that level of a resistance trend line. So I'm telling you guys, those levels of resistance trend lines really works like magic. But however, since we are actually on a downtrend, we can expect again from the market to uh, respect the same level of that resistance trend line again and might actually rise again for another 92 pips and then it's going to respect the same level of a resistance trend line. That will be actually the highest level that the gold can ever goes to before start the fall. So therefore, our new signal right now is going to be just the same one again. Sorry, guys, I know it's a little bit ret retarded, but uh, I had to just explain to you the reason behind of choosing this signal. However, our uh, safe zone is going to be changed right now to be right here at the highest level of resistance, just like that. We don't need more than that. And our take profit level is going to be changed to be right here at the absolutely bottom of the support, the uh, lowest level of the support at 2,287, which means we can look for around 320 pips and a safe zone range for around, um, you know, something we can even actually, yeah, we can make it even smaller. We don't even need that much of a safe zone, to be honest. So therefore, guys, our safe zone will be 157 pips against 320 pips of profit. So... All I need to do right now is simply draw for you. Um, just let me just do that and just write for you the number of the new take profit level, which is going to be at 2003, uh, 2287. So again, my friends, I really hope it's going to be a winner signal. And again, don't forget to join our free group of Telegram to receive such updates. It's impossible to send these updates, guys, on uh, YouTube. Therefore, make sure to join our free group of Telegram to receive those updates. And you can also give a try to our VIP group, which actually have made a lot of profit recently. We actually, we actually have changed our way of the signals. And thankfully, since ever, our signals are so profitable. And here we have received... Uh, nice message from message from the members. Uh, he have made 700 euro in just one single day using our signals. I'm so proud and I'm so happy about that. So again, guys, I hope I will see you there. So until then, I hope that was informative to you and I would like to thank you for watching.